549 is your time now on this Tuesday morning, taking a live look at FAR this morning at our FAR Bureau looking out over Interstate 2 there. Cloudy skies this morning. We've got good visibilities and the radar, unfortunately, is quiet, but it is a little bit breezy out there already this morning. Winds have been gusting up around 25 to 30 miles per hour, and they'll go up even further from there. Sustained, though, they've been closer to about 10 to 20 miles per hour. So this morning, not too bad, but by mid-morning, we'll see those winds 30 to 35 miles an hour out of the south south southeast and that will stick with us into the evening hours then they'll start to come down during the overnight hours tonight uh, high clouds still streaming in from the southwest we've seen that over the last couple of days we'll see it again so it kind of makes it look a little hazy out there uh, throughout the day. So plenty of sunshine still and those temperatures will be a little bit warmer today over yesterday. So there is future cast the yellow arrows more so across the Gulf waters this morning. Uh, we'll see again those high clouds streaming across the area and then overnight tonight we'll have clouds roll back in again and we'll have a mostly cloudy night uh, tonight into early tomorrow morning. Highs today near 90 Brownsville but into the 90s Harlingen, Rio Hondo, Raymondville, Lyford. Westward we'll see those temperatures mid 90s at McAllen, Edinburgh and then upper 90s as you go out into Star County this afternoon, and it would not surprise me to see a couple locations briefly touch that 100 degree mark out west today. And then with those winds, yeah, it's going to feel like a hair dryer out there again today. But the winds will be strongest as you get towards the coast. Out west, you go into western Hidalgo and in, into Star Counties, winds aren't as strong today. It's going to be a much uh, nicer deal there. And then tonight, they'll come, start to gradually come down by daybreak tomorrow. I don't think they'll be as strong. Uh, is what we're seeing uh, even out there this morning. Grass is still high out there. Tree pollen is low. Air quality is moderate again today because of the agricultural smoke from those burns down in Mexico coming northward on those south to southeast winds and very high once again on your UV index. That means without any sunscreen, you burn in as little as 20 minutes. All right, this is Sunday and Monday, folks. We have the cold front sliding southward. Rain chances going up a little bit, but this is the best so far we can hope out of this is maybe a tenth to a quarter of an inch and not everyone is going to see rain out of that system. So we're going to keep continuing to cross our fingers. We need it badly around here. Breezy today, 92. Winds come down tomorrow, 92. And then breezy again Thursday, Friday into Saturday with temperatures close to 90 degrees. The cold front will slide through early on Sunday, late Saturday possibly, but I think early Sunday is going to be more realistic. Ahead of it, we could see a couple of isolated showers of thunderstorms Saturday evening and then a few more as the front comes through. And then a few showers lingering into early on Monday before it all comes to an end. But we'll go out of the 90s back into the 70s and 80s for Sunday and Monday. So a little bit of a break from the heat. I think the clouds are going to be kind of helping us out too uh, with those temperatures. But regardless, um, it's not looking extremely promising. But mm. it's there and we're going to cross our fingers still.